Hey, Coach. Uh, obviously, without Lee Dort, it seems like this is kind of the way you guys are going to win offensively, hitting a lot of threes, controlling the pace, getting downhill. How was it, how encouraging was it to just see everything that you guys did on that end tonight? No, I mean, I think we you know we got other ways that we're going to be able to to play. Still kind of getting some baskets inside as well. I think we uh, uh, Malik was great for us tonight. I mean, he came in in the second half, really set some screens. His ability to pop is really going to uh, be able to – I think caused some issues for some other teams to uh, stretch them out a little bit more, but um, I still thought we, uh, we we're going to still got it. We need paint points. So even though we're not posting it, we still got to get our feet in the paint and, and driving. And I thought we left a lot of, a lot of opportunities in, in the, in the first half by not gathering and, and playing off of two feet by jumping off of one and uh, great, great opportunities. I mean, I, I think we, you know, we convert those most, most times if we just slow down a little bit, but um uh, but for the most part, I thought we, you know, we, we're going to find a way to get some points. We just got to continue to do it on the defensive end. George is one of the top three-point defense teams in the country. What led to the success, you know, shooting threes today? I, I think all, all year, we it's just a matter of whether we're making shots. It's not the quality of our shots. We've been able to get quality looks throughout the season, no matter who we play. So it's just a matter of us. Um, locking in, focusing in, and, and making our shots, and, and that's what we did tonight. I think that it opened a lot of things up for us in the in the second half to have even more driving lanes because of the, you know we shot made eight threes in the first half. Any other questions? For Coach? How important yeah, was it? Oh, Sorry, go ahead, Joey. Uh, how important was it for Miles to get going tonight? He had one of his better games of SEC play today. Yeah, I mean, Miles, it, it was good to see him make a few. I mean, went four for four today. Again, like I said, it's not a shortage of him working on it, working on his game. Just got to tighten up some other areas. I thought he had some careless turnovers, and obviously that wasn't the, the, the smartest play there at the end of the game, um, you know, following the three-point shooter with, a, with us up, having the, the cushion that we had. But those are things that we'll continue to talk about and, 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 and work on. Um, he just, you know, just doesn't have to whenever they run him off the – off the three-point line or really close out to him. And that means that he just have to put it down. So we just got to continue to work um, on him to to make the next play and, and, and make a sound play. But 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 it was glad we, we needed everything that, that he gave us tonight. Uh, Trey was huge, uh, making those free throws down the trip down down the stretch. I thought uh, you know Quentin was was unbelievable. You know, we had 11 rebounds. He went up to the line and made all three of his free throws. Tyron was good getting downhill. You know, Jordan, you know, was 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 leading out there tonight. And, and Ezra was, um, I mean, he, he ran the show. Um, all the minutes that he played, all the decisions that he made to to, to do all of that without a turnover was uh, uh, was a pretty big feat. But I, but I thought his, his pace and his control and how he defended was was a key to the victory tonight as well. Are your last one? Yeah. What impact did Ezra have defensively? Um, no, he he controlled he controlled the game. Thought he like I said he gave us uh, he really got into the ball, um, you know made made it tough on their guards and um, uh, and, I, and I thought he was he was even more aggressive tonight as, as opposed to reaching for some balls. You know he got a big steal and and, and dunk there in transition. He does a good job of moving his feet and staying in front of guys. But I think there was there's some opportunities that he's leaving on the table where he could actually poke poke some balls away. And I thought he was more aggressive tonight and, and it paid off for us. Awesome. Thank you, Coach. Appreciate it. Yeah, Tyron. Last play. Joey, you want to go first? Got the local kid back home. For sure. Uh, obviously, Gavin just mentioned it, but uh, how much did it mean to you to go home today and play the way you did and come out with a win? Uh, it means a lot, man. Uh, being able to play in front of my family and friends, uh, you know, trying to get them a show. Uh, we came out with a win. Um, you know, definitely a lot of motivation there just coming out of high school. Uh, I felt like I was good enough to come here and play, but unfortunately, they never gave me a chance. So, you know, anytime I step on the court against them, I'm looking to get the win. Aria? Yeah, Um. what was the key to the offensive success you guys had without Robbins and Dort today? Uh, for the most part, I think we just shared the ball. Uh, I'm not sure the exact numbers, but we probably had four or five guys with 12 plus points on. So we did a good job moving the ball. Everybody being aggressive, everybody stepping up, and uh, you know it paid off.